Hello guys, today we have 2020 Chevrolet Malibu. The problem with the car is the customer have changed the radar, the forward long range radar. So now we are going to check either is there any code or any DTC. So if it's need uh, programming, so we'll do the programming. So this is the code that electronic software uh, and the calibration is not learned. See, I'm trying to set the cruise the cruise is not setting it is giving me that the adaptive cruise is temporarily unavailable because of the dtc so let me show you this is the electronic control unit software and calibration is not learned so this is the core which is in the forward long range radar so let me do the calibration of this so for that we'll go back yeah i'm going back Program the video because the customer have changed it. So here are the instructions that they are saying that you the engine must be start once you drive the car. So you'll have to drive the car like for 10 to 30 minutes, and uh, while driving, this message will be up here: uh, service drive assist. And you should drive the car above 56 miles uh, 56 kilometer per hour so and also you should maintain 30 to 50 meter of distance between other cars and try to drive the car on the straight road so now we are going on the road so once we are on the road we will activate it in progress still so
so as you guys can see that the message is gone and the uh, calibration is successfully done so i can uh, set the i can activate the cruise and i have already activated as you can see the green uh, small car in the uh, uh, instrument cluster panel so this is a procedure you can follow for a successful program as you can see now the adaptive cruise is working so let me show you it's automatically braking and uh, automatically is acceleration and decelerating and here you can set the gap far far or near so i'll keep it far because as you can see that once it is getting close to the car so the speed is reducing so it means that the radar is working and so to maintain the distance so it's automatically accelerating and deceleration so our program is successful sometimes it's taking the program is taking like uh, 10 minutes sometimes it's taking more than 30 minutes so you should be patient while programming the radar because sometimes it's really hard to program the radar because whenever i'm trying to programming sometimes it's taking like one day or two days to program or sometimes it's taking like uh, half or to successful program the main thing is to check at the, the level of the radar and the brackets all the thing are properly installed so if all the thing are properly installed so the radar will work properly and the program will be successful within 10 to 15 minutes if the radar uh, bracket is not installed properly or either the alignment of the radar is not uh, properly aligned so it will uh, not take the program and the carbon there will not be a successful program as you can see my foot are off the back and uh, accelerator it is automatically decelerating the uh, speed as you can see i'm not touching the brake pedal and the accelerator so it is working successfully now it's increasing the speed also decreasing at the same time for more videos please uh, like our page and subscribe it thank you very much for watching our video